Good morning, my loves. It's snowing. It is, well, it snowed. I don't know if it will snow again, <laughs> but I'm so excited about it. I've never seen it snow in London before. Like I know I've only lived here a year, but it didn't snow last winter and I was convinced like it probably just doesn't really snow in London. <laughs> Whereas where I'm from in Scotland, we get a little bit of snow every single year. So I'm so happy to see snow. It is early. Oh my God, it is early. <laughs> I've booked myself a little morning Pilates class for like half six. And so that helps just get me up nice and early. I feel like my body clock's just been off for the past like almost three weeks now with New York, the jet lag and then Paris. So I just needed a morning <laughs> to like really get my ass in gear. It is Monday morning. Welcome back to Vlogmas. I know there was no video yesterday. I just really needed that Sunday. Like I wasn't, I don't know, I wasn't in the mood and I'd rather not force out content. I know this is Vlogmas and like you're meant to power through, but again, I'd rather not give you like boring content. So today is gonna be a productive day. Sorting out my life and we're starting nice and early. I've been loving Pilates class. Such a fun, like different workout. Let's go. <laughs> a hard class oh my god i'm out now i literally feel a bit sick <laughs> i think it's because i had a takeout last night and so my belly's just like Ugh. plus i haven't done a workout class in like three weeks but i feel good it's still dark outside look at your snoozy puppy yeah were you snoozing were you snoozing when mommy came home do you know it's snowing today it's snowing. You haven't even seen snow that much in your life. This is my very realistic work from home with me outfit. Today is actually kind of a busy day. I have a very exciting video that involves Notion. I'm planning for 2023 and oh my god, I'm so excited, but I need to pre-prepare today. Um, I'm putting together like a big template and I want to get it right. So it's taking me a while. <laughs> I have had so many questions about this jumper because um, I wore it over on Instagram and I think I've already worn it in videos. Like I can't take this off. It's from Kiwi & Co, literally one of my favorite brands ever. I'm gonna make some breakfast. I'm thinking just oatmeal, like something filling. And then we're gonna have to take Mochi out so that he can go to the toilet and also have a little walk, but like obviously it can't be too long because his little pawsies will freeze off. Guys, I have such cute pieces to show you from Naked. They are very kindly working with me on this part of the video. So I'm gonna give you guys a little haul of like some of my favorite clothing bits from recently. I have worn all of these pieces in New York and Paris. I have been blown away by Naked's quality of clothing. I always saw them pop up on Instagram because their stuff is super cute, super trendy, and also really affordable. So I've been wanting to try them for the longest time. And now I can share these pieces with you. I will have all of these pieces linked in the description bar. Naked offer free climate compensated shipping and returns. Also, I'm gonna put this at the start so you don't miss it. If you use my discount code Becca Watson, it gives you 30% off everything to new customers and 15% off to returning customers. That is on everything, including sale. It's only valid for a week, so be quick, don't miss out. You'll need to create an account and be logged in at checkout for the discount to work. And um, without further ado, let's just get into it. I'll show you guys. You have probably already seen these in vlogs. Okay, the number one piece, I think my favorite is this suit set. 
in the color gray. Gray is just the color of the season in my opinion. So I paired this set with a gray scarf as well in New York and it made the cutest photo. I actually had someone come up to me as well in New York and ask where my matching suit was from, which was so flattering. So first of all, let's talk about this blazer. If you don't know, get to know. Naked do the best blazers. I feel like because I'm short, I'm quite petite, I'm like 5'3", I find it really, really challenging to find a blazer that just looks right on me. But when I do, I love it. I got this in a size 34. There's nothing more sleek than pairing your blazer with the matching trousers. I love these as well. They're really like short people friendly. They sit so well on me. The issue I have with a lot of these sort of like tailored trousers is that I end up stepping on the ends of them and then the ends get wrecked or I need to get them tailored. That has not been the case with these. I love them so much. A piece that's a little bit out of my comfort zone but I'm so glad I went for it. I styled this in New York with a black blazer and I just felt so confident. This is such a nice evening outfit. So it's a long feathery dress in this like creamy white color. Looks like such high quality. This doesn't molt either, which is really nice. I saw the model on the website paired this with a black blazer and some boots. So that's how I went about this and I absolutely loved it. Again, for reference, I got this in a 36. Then you can't go wrong with a basic tank. I just got a classic white like, racer neck. Is that what you call these? Racer neck tank, size extra small. Then, oh my gosh, I love this jacket so much. I got this beautiful brown leather trench. I feel like I've seen long leather trenches in season this year and I really wanted like this kind of chocolatey brown color in a jacket. The model on the website just looked insane wearing this. Pair this with some sunnies, chunky gold jewelry and you just look the fit is actually quite oversized, which I really like. I got these like statement gold earrings. I do not own anything like this and I feel like whenever I'm out and I see a girl with an amazing outfit and it's like that thing tying that outfit together, in my mind, always tends to be the jewelry and how she's like accessorized her outfit. These aren't too heavy. I feel like they sit on my ears quite comfortably. The last piece I got were these earrings, just like simple little everyday hoops. I love these so much. They came in a set. So that second hoop there is a tiny bit smaller. These are now my like go-to everyday earrings. If you haven't shot from Naked before, do it. You won't regret it. Their stuff is so, so nice. Treat yourself for the Christmas season. You can use my code on the screen to say some money. Again, all the links will be in the description bar. A huge thank you to Naked for sponsoring this part of the video. Okay, let's put together just a really quick to-do list for today so I don't completely lose track. I need to like give Mochi a shower today and other weird not that that's been that weird but like miscellaneous tasks around the house. You guys, it's obviously so much later. I've barely spoken to you throughout the like middle afternoon chunk of this day. It looks like it is literally hours later because it's getting dark, but it does just get dark super early now. But I have had a very, very productive start to my day. I, but I spent this whole time just working on this thing for Notion. What's the time? It is half three. I, in my mind, and had scheduled for all of this to be finished by like one, but it's because I want it looking like sleek. And oh my gosh, I love Notion. It's like crazy how much you can do on there. But anyway, video on all of that coming very soon. And I've had this beautiful view the whole time of all the snow. Okay, I wore my little Tasman Uggs in Paris once. And the thing with Paris is, I don't know, the streets, your shoes just pick up a lot of grub. So, I'm meaning to do this. Got some random cleaner, suede cleaner. Oh God, I hope this doesn't work them. Okay. 
Okay, I think I need the actual Ugg cleaner. The work day is almost done. I just have a quick meeting. You know those days when you've just been staring at a screen all day Ugh, and your eyes just feel a bit square. So I am actually gonna make the effort, make the time to read a little bit because I'm finishing up earlier than normal. It's only half four. I don't know, rather than going ahead and calling it a day, turning on Netflix and everything, I have some extra time. And so, so many people have read this book. I tried to read it, I think like, two years ago now but i've been way better at reading this year saying that though i have fallen out of the habit for the past two months because of just a lot happening i know that's always always everyone's excuse but i figured let's give this like a 20 minute read might be longer if i'm really enjoying it and i'm in the mood for something like this like a feel good inspirational motivational book Okay, something this family needs to do this evening that we've all been putting off. Bath time. Mochi. Bath time. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, I know. But you're just a big boy now, so. It doesn't even phase you. Oh, goodness me. Boy. Okay, dinner time. As per usual. Hello Fresh. However, this week I forgot to pick my recipes, so it's fine though. This looks pretty good. We have a loaded sweet potato, sweet potato, Jackie P. Nom nom nom. So I think I'm gonna make this, and then we'll hang out, right? Yeah. But right now Will's gonna socialize with his other friends. My my gamer buddies. So we just watched this film, Surge, the fellow we saw in New York, <laughs> um, and it was so good. Say his name. Ben Wishel, I think. Say it with conviction. Conviction. Ben Wishel. This evening has just been very, very chill. Um, it's 9 p.m. It's like really early, but since got up very early today, I'm feeling tired and Will start feeling a bit poorly. I think he's caught whatever I had over the past few days. So I think we're just gonna go to bed, call it a day. Um, but thank you guys for watching. Sorry about missing Vlogmas yesterday. I don't know. I hopefully it won't miss anymore. If yeah, I don't know. We'll see. It's hard to predict because, like I said, I'd always rather put out something I'm proud of and I think is actually worth watching rather than a really boring day. Um, it is crazy going from like one video a week and that's all you see from my week to trying to film something every day. It's very different. It's a very different challenge. But anyway, today has been good. I'm glad I made it to that Pilates class. That is honestly the way to get me out of bed book a really early class like I'll lose my money <laughs> if I don't go so that's like a little tip but anyway I'll see you guys in tomorrow's vlog thank you so much for your love and support and yeah I love you good night